However, uh, probably I don't. Well, he did, but he, you know, he that was uh, the week before. But yeah, he. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm mixing your weeks up. Yeah, I am mixing my weeks up. Remember, that's it, when then then Gregory started his crap and took off without him. Right, and then they did it again. Yes, they did do it again, didn't they? See, my brain is not all the way together there, but <laughs> yeah, I'll go back. I'll go back to the beginning and look. <laughs> that's okay. That's good. But, it's yeah, all good. But it's, anytime they used those cars and the way they had them all, God, you those know, were awesome. They're just like little tanks. Yeah, they, it was so cool. You they know? they pull up like in sequence and. Bam, 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 yeah. Bam. yeah, I love it. I thought I think that was such a great idea. But yeah, they have everything planned. Who's going to do what? And I mean, right to the last, yeah. right to the what every single car is going to do, what every single person is going to do. Yeah. So they have it. So you know, they all have each other's backs that way because they all have their own their their own jobs that they have to do. Right. So it's it's. It's pretty amazing. Yeah. It's pretty amazing. Yeah. Aaron and Eric out there, they're pretty cool. I was like, you oh, go, Aaron. Yes. <laughs> you go, Aaron. Aaron has become quite the little leader. Yeah. When he's come from, when he came from being such a pansy behind, underneath his mama's skirt. Yeah. yeah. If we remember. Uh-huh. So, yeah. Aaron has become a... Um, and Eric too. He it took him a while yeah. to get the program, but he he did. He finally yep. did. Yep. So that was pretty cool. Um, and of course, you have the you know everybody's where they're supposed to be. Um, what did you think about Tara and Jesus? Okay. <laughs> I have to say, I'm Team Tara all the way. Woohoo! That's my girl. I have been Team Tara for quite a while. Um, it's really amazing to me how Tara came from all those years ago, and I was mentioning this to my son, that Tara came from all those years ago, this scared child almost, yeah. under the governor's, brainwashed by the governor. Well, yeah. Yeah. And then was found and said, you know, and admitted right away, you know, I was with the governor. Right. And how she was able to work her way up to get everybody to trust her. And she's a leader now. <coughs> oh, yeah, definitely. Definitely totally a leader. And she's a good leader. And, you know, hey, she has a babe like Rosita. But she's gone through, she's lost so many loves that have meant so much to her. And I don't think Rosita means as much to her as like, what was her name? The last one that she lost. Oh, Denise? Yes. The doctor, yeah. Yes, she was her love of her life. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it was... uh, yeah, so she's come a long way. Yeah, she I, has, she has. And I just, I love her. I, so love I, her. I loved her in the first episode, too, with the licorice, you know, close enough. Oh. Uh, she was just... <laughs> what the Twizzler. Yeah, oh, I love it, God. I love it. That was great. Um, yeah, and Team Taylor. Well, Twizzlers are even worse, so... I mean, you know, when they're stale. Yeah, yeah. And they're... Yeah. I don't know how she could even be chewy. Uh, I know, she was like... So oh, brittle. yeah. She was like, they were gross. <laughs> yeah, maybe it, maybe it complimented, maybe it just complimented the, her watch and her watch as it's yeah, ticking could, down. Yeah, but, it, it, you know, uh, she she really has, and I'm Team Terror too. They went in there. The plan was kill them all. Because if you don't, they're going to come back and kill you. So um, that dude, they should have uh, killed him on the spot, no doubts. Um So, what did you think of when they uh, Ezekiel and them were fighting those walkers? And he, he hear the music in the background. It was freaking great. It was like his organ music playing. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, that's so appropriate for this because King Ezekiel. Uh, One thing I was really bummed about this episode is, damn it! 
I wanted to find out what find. I'm sorry, I shouldn't use that language. I wanted to find out what happened to Gabriel. Oh yeah, well you know they weren't going to tell us right away. Uh, we'll yeah, probably next episode. I think so. Back to it. Yeah, I think so. But still, I wanted to know. I mean, I know that's the way they do it. They'll leave you hanging for oh. maybe one or two episodes, uh-huh. and then they'll come back to it. Mm-hmm. So. Yep. That just is frustrating as hell to me. <laughs> it is, but it keeps you on your seat. It really does. So what did you think about Morgan? When all, all of a sudden, all you see was three three bodies going backwards. That was crazy. Oh, my gosh. When he got up. I, set, I, thought, uh, he, I thought he was a walker at first. I didn't. I didn't. Because when he sat up, his face was totally normal. Yeah. At first, I thought when he started moving, not when he got up. When he got up, that man was ticked off. But, man, and the way he was walking, um, you know, and I don't know if that armor he was wearing, because I don't know, who knows what that armor was made of. Yeah, yeah, we don't know. I mean, it looked like he had a Kevlar vest on. You know, I'm sure they got some of those. Like. Yeah, it looks like they got some of those. You know, I'm sure they did along the way. And that hurts just as bad. Oh, yeah. My understanding. Yeah. So, I've never been shot while I was wearing it. Yeah. But those, I've had one of those on before, and they're very, very, very heavy. Yeah, yeah, they are. So, yeah. But, yeah, um, that was one ticked off man going through that building. <laughs> Pop, pop, pop. He was just popping everybody. It was great. I know. It was like, maybe think of the gunslinger. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And the way he was walking was such, you know, that's the first thing I thought of was, was the gunslinger. The way he was walking, he had yeah. the guns like this, and yep. he, he, he was just ready. Yep. Man. Boom, 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 boom. So, Every one of you we saw. Yep. Okay, so now we're in the woods with um, Ezekiel and Carol. Because yes. they're tracking okay. that savior that grenaded them. And they want yep. to get to him before he gets to that outpost. Um, what was up with that walker? Yeah. It, it looked like he had... Um, uh, the way it's described is it looked more like a vampire from the Blade or Underworld movies. Pale skin, elven ears, and decaying bat-like features. Yeah. And Ezekiel's like, what befell this creature? <laughs> what yeah. befell this creature? He, I love King Zeke and his, his monologue. It cracks me up. He's just uh, he's just so kingy, kingly. Uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but that, that walker was totally okay. bizarre. I wonder if there's uh, something else going on we don't know about. Yeah. You know? Uh, yeah. I, yeah, that, that, that. because, yeah, I mean, yeah, it looked weird. It did. To say the least. Yeah. It looked really weird. And, uh, but Ezekiel, what befell this creature? I love him. He's so great. And then there's Jerry. Yeah. Smack with the axe in the head. Gotta love Jerry. He, <laughs> he just, he's something else. He just cracks me up. He's such a great character. Yeah, yeah. And when it when it when it uh, comes down to when he uh, he says, uh, uh, you know, and it, you know, Carol, you know, is perplexed by Ezekiel's confidence. Yes, yes. He, he she's says, not so ready to say yeah, you know. Yeah, and he says, uh, he says, uh, did you make me lose my spot? Yeah. <laughs> my dog walked right across the screen. <laughs> and so, of course, it moved. Um, yeah. He says, uh, it, he says his confidence comes from no and yes, yes and no, and then finally, yes to both. Both being the feeling of some divine confidence and simply project projecting some certainty so he he um it's, his confidence is is all that is all that he really has you yeah, know yeah it's fake it till you make it baby and that's that's, that's how it is you fake it till you make it so good for right. him and he's great yep. at it um 
And but you know that furthers terror in Jesus' conflict. Is there a good and bad side? Uh, can they still be good if they commit acts of evil? Well, if they don't, they're just going to kill them. It's yeah, but, it's a matter of self preservation at this point. Yes, because they do know that um, he has to understand, and that's what Jesus has to get through his head. Right. Is that if they don't kill them, they're going to kill. If they yeah. don't kill them, they're going to kill him and, and his entire family. Oh, and they'll kill everybody. Everybody else. Yeah, that's the, you know that's Negan rules by fear, and that's how he does it. Yeah. And but if you let them go. Uh, in a way, I can understand, okay, take a few prisoners. Maybe they can get some information or whatever. But in the end, don't let them live because they're just going to come back for you. There is yep. no ifs, ands, or buts about the saviors. They will come back on your butt. Yep. And um, apparently they wounded that savior, so uh, they picked his trail up. Daryl and Rick are in the building. Rick's got that map from Dwight. They're looking for the guns. Right. Um. And Daryl, and they can't find them. No, it's not on the uh, bottom floor. So they're saying, "Well, the only way is up." That's a good, you know, stronghold. So um, Daryl finds uh, one of those closets he was in. Do you remember that? Yes. With a half-eaten sandwich and bloodstains on the floor, and handcuffs attached to a pipe. Uh, you know, deja vu there. Yeah, that's exactly what he thought of. Yeah. Yeah. That was, was kind of freaky and sad and just kind of, you know, bringing back really bad memories for him. Probably yeah. getting him more pissed off than he already is. Oh, definitely. And he's not so sure about Dwight to a point. You know, yes, Dwight's been feeding him information. He's been right so far, but... Uh, <laughs> what if... Yeah, Daryl's like... Daryl's like... Leading them into a trap one of these times. <laughs> well, Daryl's not so sure. And he calls him a butthole. Right. Less than 72 hours, 88 miles per hour will be on iHot Radio. Congrats, Lori. Woohoo! Oh! Yes. Yay. Yes. Thank you. Hi, Yay. Congrats. Yay. Hi, Ike. How you doing? Um, are you Team Jesus or Team Tara, Ike? Let us know. Yeah, Daryl's like, um, and I'm going to quote here uh, so everybody doesn't get excited. He's still an asshole, uh, according to Daryl. So, (laughs) I was just like, yeah, Daryl, he is. Um, (laughs) So, he's not so sure about him. Although, Rick says, you know, so far, all the information's been good. Um, Rick goes into a room, and he's attacked by one of the saviors. Yes. Oh, yeah. 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 Why is the savior there? Yeah. And then, yeah, that bloody brawl ends with him impaling the bearded man on a spike on the wall. I was like, oh, yeah. Good job. Yep. I was but like, while he's choking him out, the savior says there's no guns. Yeah. Yeah. So did Rick have faulty information, or is this oh, another I don't lie? know. It could be just uh, a plan of the saviors. You know, if something happens, the guns get taken first. You know, that, that to me that would be a normal type thing to do. Right. You know, that would be a plan in place in case something would happen. You know, I'm not leaving the guns there. So right. um, no, I don't think it was faulty information. I just think that the saviors also planned. Oh. Are you Team Jesus or Team Tara, Ike? Do you see the last episode? So, Team Tara or Team Jesus? Yeah. Did Rick have faulty? Oh, is this another lie? I don't know. I could have been, like, basically faulty information because if I was... We never got to the end of the search, though, did we? No, did no, not no. yet. Not yet. Um, I think, you know, if I was them, if I would have a plan in place. Oh, yeah, you go, like, woo Team Tara. That's right, that's right. Um, We're Team Tara, too, all the way. You know it, all the way, all the way. 
Um, I would have a plan in place. Questions later. Yeah. Um, 